It's a love letter to mucus. Yeah. Mucus. Let's go into the lab and see if we can find some mucus. What a great idea. The scientists keep these mucus membranes wet. They sure do. Surfaces. Abstract. Mucus is a slimy hydrogel that lines the mucosal surfaces in our body, including the intestines, stomach, eyes, lungs, and urogenital tract. There's a lot of different kinds of mucus proteins. They're all over the different human body systems. This glycoprotein-rich network is truly the jack of all trades. As a barrier, it lubricates surfaces, protects our cells from physical stress, and selectively allows the passage of nutrients while clearing out pathogens and debris. As a home to our microbiota, it supports a level of microbial diversity that is unattainable with most culture methods. As a reservoir of complex carbohydrate structures called glycans, it plays critical roles in controlling cell adhesion and signaling, and it alters the behavior and spatial distribution of microbes. On top of all this, mucus regulates the passage of sperm during fertilization, heals wounds, helps us smell, and prevents the stomach from digesting itself, to name just a few of its functions. Given these impressive features, it is no wonder that mucus crosses boundaries of species and kingdoms. Mucus gels are made by organisms ranging from the simplest metazoans to corals, snails, fish, and frogs. It is also no surprise that mucus is exploited in everyday applications, including foods, cosmetics, and other products relevant to medicine and industry. That sounds like a dynamite paper! It's going to be a hit! slime, and mucin flow properties, and their implications for defense. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>